And when it comes to speaker uh, selection, there are tons and tons of choices out there. There are uh, two ways and three ways, and then you can use subwoofers with them and so forth. There's active and inactive. An active speaker is one with a built-in amplifier. A passive speaker is one without. Um, now, one of the common uh, thoughts is, and it's not necessarily correct thought, but is that if you get a 15-inch uh, speaker cab instead of a 12-inch, that you're going to lose some low end. Well, that's true to a degree, but it's not that much low end. I personally prefer the sound of a 12-inch speaker, especially if I'm running subwoofers, because it sounds tighter. And there's a term that we uh, oftentimes will use the larger the speaker, the more it'll coast. So when the, in, the frequency hits it, it'll vibrate a little longer. It won't be as tight. And there is a, um, you know, a lot to learn about speakers and so forth. But if you're on a tight budget, uh, the best thing to do is invest most of your money in good speakers and good microphones. And then the electronics in between won't be as important, even though it is very, very important. But the transducers, that which changes one form of energy into another form of energy, which is your microphones and speakers, really need to be of, uh, of a good high quality to get that real pristine sound.